Meg being sued. Harry fed up with Meghan as she gets taste of her own medicine with latest lawsuit. Royal expert Daniela Elza said, Meghan Markle is being sued. And it's a horrible development not only for her and Prince Harry, but also the Queen. Ah, can you smell that? Not the hint of autumn in the air but the irony, the irony that today as Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex finds herself embroiled in a new legal fight, this time, she's the one being sued, having been accused in court documents of lying about her family. Over the course of the last two and a half years, Meghan and her husband Prince Harry have launched a flurry of lawsuits, including against the Mail on Sunday, The Sun, The Mirror, US paparazzi agencies X-17 and Splash. The couple have also called in the lawyers over media coverage about their choice to co-opt the Queen's nickname for their daughter and the Mail on Sunday's report about his battle with the UK's Home Office over the removal of his official police protection. Over the weekend, the news broke that Meghan's older half-sister Samantha Markle, and permanent thorn in her side, has filed a defamation suit of her own against her titled sibling in a Florida court, accusing Meghan of false and malicious lies and of propagating a false narrative and fairy tale life story. It's not a great start for Samantha's legal contingent here given they managed to get his title wrong straight out of the gate. Netflix's least productive hire, so far anyway, is actually officially called Prince Henry of Wales. If the case proceeds, Meghan could potentially be interviewed under oath and it's at this point the alarm bells should be ringing not only in Montecito but London too. Samantha, according to a new report, is planning to possibly forensically challenge the claims raised during the royal couple's bombshell prime time TV interview last year. Nothing is off-limits if the Duchess is deposed, a source close to the case has told the Mirror. Samantha's lawsuit focuses heavily on claims made by the Duchess when she spoke to Oprah. They include details on how little Meghan says she knew her half-siblings, but also about the life she had when growing up. Samantha, who shares the same dad with Meghan, does not recognize much of what the Duchess said and wants to challenge it all by making her sister sit for a deposition. Everything will be forensically challenged. For sure, Samantha hopes Meghan will be tested on all aspects of the Oprah program, including claims she made about the royals. The same goes for Meghan too here. Samantha has accused her royal half-sister of having falsely claimed that she had grown up in virtual poverty. Last year, in a letter sent to top Washington leaders pushing for paid parental leave, the Duchess of Sussex wrote, I grew up on the $4.99 salad bar at Sizzler, I knew how hard my parents worked to afford this because even at five bucks, eating out was something special. However, Samantha's court documents allege that Meghan was not forced at the age of 13 to work in low-paying jobs to make ends meet. Defendant attended elite and expensive private schools and dance and acting classes in Los Angeles paid for by her father and that Thomas Markle was a was a highly successful television lighting director who paid for all of defendant's college education at Northwestern, including tuition, rent and living expenses. At stake here for Meghan is her credibility. Late last year she had to apologize to the court in London for forgetting she had sent a detailed email to her then press secretary before he met with the authors of the biography Finding Freedom. Or, during the Oprah interview, Meghan said the couple had got married three days before their wedding only for the Archbishop of Canterbury appearing to contradict. The question here is, could Meghan afford to potentially have holes poked in her narrative about her upbringing? He is hoping Her Majesty has some change left over from helping Andrew with this legal mess. She might have to make another generous bank transfer to get the royal family out of another legal pickle again soon.